Off the Menu captures the role food plays in people's lives, connecting family, culture, and community. When I was growing up in Missouri in the 80s, we were one of the only Korean families in town. You know, we sort of kept our kimchi to ourselves in our basement refrigerator, um, and nobody ever, you know, we never exposed it to anybody. You can find it in quesadillas, on top of gourmet burgers, and on the shelf at Costco. Kimchi's coming out gets me thinking about how food defines me. Over the past two decades, filmmaker Grace Lee says Americans have become much more aware of Asian cuisine because of the influence of a growing Asian American community and Asian immigrants. In Texas, Gary Chu, the son of Taiwanese immigrants, runs Banyan Foods, the oldest tofu factory in the state. So we are evolving from an Asian American business to an Asian Latino American business. Not only because of the products we sell, but because of our employees. Our pro employees are Latino. In 2000, we started doing tofu egg rolls. In 2005, we started doing tofu tamales, which is a Asian Tex-Mex fusion. By presenting the history and the stories behind the food, filmmaker Grace Lee hopes Off the Menu gives people a better understanding of the experience of Asian Pacific Americans. Off the Menu ends its journey in Hawaii, where most of the state's food is now imported, but it wasn't always like that. These days, some Native Hawaiians continue to gather food just like their ancestors. Hi'ilei Cavello learned how to do it from her father, Gabby Cavello. Hi'ile says being able to carry on their cultural traditions is an important part of her identity, and preserving their island way of life means a lot to her family. All my life we've been in the water, gathering whatever we can to survive. But the mainstay for our family is octopus. This is something that's basically sustained our family in this area for eight generations. The whole point of a luau is that the family comes together and you're pooling the resource that's either grown or harvested. And so when you eat it, you're eating the essence of all the skills from passed on from generation to generation. When you take that bite of that food, you're eating that. For VOA News, I'm Heidi Chang in Honolulu. You take more pictures of food.